Hey guys, so much for watching this My name is AJ. Welcome back to the episode of Let's Build a City. Today, I want to try something a little bit unique, something that we haven't got anywhere in the city, in fact. And uh, it's just a hey, a sheep in in skyscraper district. <laughs> I think he's actually made his way from all the way over there and just sort of slowly, like step by step, made it. Hey there, buddy. How we doing? Oh, he's, he's going even further. Maybe he's going to the church, the cathedral. Sort of want to just follow a sheep now for <laughs> half an hour. Well, you're heading the right way for today's episode. Maybe you'll come and join me later. On this skyscraper right here. Well, that's a beauty, isn't it? We've got this entrance. And I thought it would be really cool to try and make this go down into... Like, you know how we've got the multi-story car park over there? But an underground one. But I don't want it like three or four floors. In fact, I probably won't want it even two floors. I just want it to go down underground so it can't be seen from up here. And, and have some car parking spots down there with some pillars. Wow, at this funky glitching. What is going on there? Look. That is super weird in that area. Let's give it a that. So yeah, that would be really, really cool. Now... This is wide enough for one car to get through. Uh, well, well, technically, you could just squeeze. Cars are, th like, three blocks wide. So you could just get uh, two cars to fit side by side. I don't think, though, I'm going to bother to readjust the entire skyscraper just for us to get, like, another block or two of width. Like, no. And I'm not going to do, like, an exit on the other side. I don't think... I can. If it's actually, if it's, if it's really simple to do, I might. So you've got some above car park, uh, above parking here. You know, we could. I think that is literally in line with where I need it to be. Now, how did how would this go? Because I think that's the same sort of thing, isn't it? If we grab that. So that goes along. It's like two blocks each window. Then that goes along. And then that and then the glass. Okay. Looks like we've already basically got it then. So that goes along there. Boom. Then that must sit back here then, does it? Like that. No, that can't be right. That's too small. That's in line with that. Well, how in tarnation does this go then? One, two, three, four, five, six blocks of glass there. Six blocks of glass there. How to work then? Ah. Okay, light colour and then that. If we, if we could do this, then we could just have a straight through. So it goes like... None of, the, none of this makes sense, guys. None of this makes sense at all. Around from the inside of that. Here. Oh, ah, got it. It's all clicked. <laughs> and ta da. <laughs> oh, at last. Okay, so that would then give us a, a in way and an out way. I haven't decided which one's going to be which yet. I don't think it's going to make any difference at all. Uh,. So if we do that there, set stone, we get some of this. Uh, in fact, let's make this the in. So that's the that's the in. Uh, I can't do an arrow all that easy unless I do two small arrows. Uh, if I'm going to do two small arrows, I need the other way, which is going to be that one. And I need those. 
and we do something like that and that like two arrows going in and then on this side we've got the line for like the give way and then we'll just stick that on there we'll get a wool and we'll get a red for the little stop sign perfect okay so we come in from this way we then need it to drop underground somehow smoothly uh, but quickly enough for us to get down to get a decent car park underneath now i think the best tactic for us to do here will be to actually dig down a little bit like this and just hollow it out and then we'll put the roof uh, the, the or, or like a, a floor if you like back down again afterwards just so we know where we're working with uh what space that we've got hello water that's unusual must oh this must have been where like the lake originally was then is it falling it's falling okay no vision potion so you guys can see and me i'm struggling i'm sort of turning my head in a weird way Did that make no splash sound it's not making a splash sound um so yeah, let's drop this down. We need to go as early as possible. So maybe literally just as the arrows finish. And I think the smoothest that you can do on an incline is two blocks. Two or three blocks. Is it like on that bridge there? I think that's three. What about on this one here? Three. Yeah, I think three three is is the best i think two and it's a little bit too uh too steep of a gradient so we go like that and then it goes back to full blocks and then it goes to this see i don't want to go too far down because otherwise you're not actually going to get any space it's just going to be like a tunnel that goes underneath which is quite cool but not really all that useful Depending on how much room we actually have left over here, we might have to go, we might have to squeeze it to a two. Because at the moment, if we left it there, we're not even underground yet. And um, and we're not really down deep enough, are we? Like, we might have to force this to be a little bit, I think we're going to have to. Otherwise, you're not actually going to get any car parking spots, are you? It's just going to go down and then it's going to come back up. like i think that's deep enough i think we can get away with that and and that would work it would feel like when you're going down it would feel like you're going underground so if we pull this across here uh okay how many blocks in or what, what are we lining up we're lining it up with one or we're lining up with this gray is when it starts to drop down so that gray here still more water there <laughs> that's gonna cause issues yeah but the uh the path actually goes around it so let's make sure we do that as well i thought that was a little bit something wasn't right on the side uh. okay we're good that's made it m m neater as well down there so we want that to go down. Why does it feel so much deeper on this side? Oh, I suppose the building isn't perfectly symmetrical, is it? It's an odd shaped, odd shape sort of internally. Oh my. Um, let's get rid of some of this. <laughs> Somehow. Yeah, I think the I think the lake originally ran through here. Like when we first started the world, I actually had uh, quite a large lake that went through, and then I just reduced it over. Uh, I think just before the series started, in fact, it was reduced a, a fair amount. 
Okay, perfect. That gives us a decent amount down here to have car parking spots on either side. That's good. That's good. Let's then fill this in. Uh, I think, you know what, the quickest is just going to be to do it by hand. Uh, this. We'll get the, the in and out sorted first. And then I, I, I'd really like to have like little pillars down here that hold it up that you sort of have to miss. Almost like, oh, what is the game? Dry, driver. Is it dri the, the original driver game? And it had like this insanely difficult underground car park tutorial. But it was ridiculous. Like you had to jade to, was it driver? Or driver two or something like that. It wasn't driver three. I think it was. I think it was either driver one or driver two, and and you start off in this underground car park, and it has like these pillars in the middle and stuff, and it tells you the controls for your how to drive the car, and uh, there's like this checklist that you need to follow and tick them all off as you go before you can leave, and it is like insanely hard, like to do J turns and like figures of eight, uh, weaving chicanes and stuff like this. Uh, it's just it chucks you straight into the game. It's, it's crazy. I think a lot of games sort of back then though had like a super steep learning curve. Like now it's a little bit more, it's sort of every game sort of gently progresses in. Um, but yeah, it, 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 back then it was just like, yeah, you'll learn how to do it. You, you'll figure it out. So we'll just drop that down there. Um, that's probably going to be the wall anyway, so we don't need to worry about that. Let's fix it on this side as well. I don't need to worry about any dotted lines through the middle because it's going to be a one way system. Again, they don't need to be there. We don't need to worry about that or that. Ugh. Okay, sweet. So now that we're down here, we can grab ourselves a one because that will be faster now. And I'm going to go from here to. Oops. There. I think. <laughs> okay. Got a nice sort of square out here. This will be walls here. Because there's no point in having little, little spots down there. You're just never going to manage to get there. So that'll be... I think a drop down like that is quite neat. Probably like that, in fact. So it sort of keeps the... Um, yeah, three, four, two, works out, works out sort of number-wise very nice as well. Okay, is it the same up here? One, two, one, two, three, four, yes. Great, I like it when it all works out. One, two, one, two, three, four, oh, a little bit of water nearly came out then. Okay, brilliant. Um... One, two, three, four, five. I can't really go any deeper than that. So I need to be careful here on how we design this next part. Oops. Nearly messed up. So that's going to be set 159.9. So I need to leave enough room to make the car parking spots deep enough to be able to get a car. I mean, otherwise there's really no point. Um, which means that this part is going to have to be the wall. I think we'll probably do clay. So I've got a perfect sort of underground colour for it. You won't be able to get vans and stuff down here. So maybe we'll have to put like a height limit on, on outside. To make sure people don't bring cars in that are too tall. Yeah, because it's, it's, it's going to be tight down here. Well, at least on, basically, I just need it tighter on that one block. So we can have this one block, like, in fact, I probably won't make it out of clay. I'll probably make it out of uh, a different color, a different block. Probably like um, an andesite. I think that would work. I think that would work quite well on the inside. In fact, we might run this all of the way round. We might even run like down here as well. I think that design-wise would work well as well. Now, 
this has to be a little bit taller than two blocks so because of how like how, just how it works how, how how this kind of thing just does from experience <laughs> uh, so you can actually get the car down yeah that should work we shall try it ourselves and sort of work on this part first we sort we sort of know how the rest of this is going to go pretty much now uh so if we could run this it would be really nice if we could get that in there yeah and then slab probably this one Gives a real concrete, like, esque feel. Ah, stop placing on the wrong one. And then... That will be like that. So then you sort of drop that one down like there. Feels nice down here. Feel on the approach. Uh, night vision. We'll have to think about lighting as well. Okay, that will go like that. Let's sort of wrap around. Like so. Perfect. We'll worry about the other side in a minute. I just want to get like one half of it working. Like that. And then I think... I'll probably do it like this and then this goes around like that and I think that would work the best and then this obviously I might even drop it down again I don't know let me get this done on this side so that we've just got the middle to worry about and I'll be back okay so symmetrical now on both sides and I think I'm going to leave this part open first before we work out if I want these slabs on this level or this level. Because I think I might end up wanting it on this level so we can place a full block below it for the pillars and it fits in the top. Um, but I'm really, really unsure. So, let's get some lines. Let's see how many car parking spots we can get in here. And also, is it the right one? Nope, never is. <laughs> and if uh like like how they spread out and where we're going to put the pillars so if we said there 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 and there that leaves me two blocks remaining so if we move that over that over and that over this is this is going to be so tricky to work out, isn't it? That's one, two, and one, two. And then in the middle... Ah, perfect. Yeah, no, that works. No, it's not the middle. It's not the middle. Both of those would be the middle. That'd be one, two, three. One, two, three. Hmm. Okay. What if... Let's reset. What if instead we put the lines here? And I do that one, that one, and that one. And then I go here, and I do that one, that one, and that one. That gives me a couple of blocks in the middle here. Not quite. What I want is I want I want at least four pillars. I want like a pillar here, 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 and here. Basically, it's something like that. So if we can get them to line up correctly sort of with that i don't mind if we do like um a, a slightly bigger first spot or something like that splash let's say one two three four five six seven blocks to that one one two three four five six seven blocks to that one one two three four five six yeah what does that mean then <laughs> how does this help me in any way well then that take these wagon 
if the pillar's going to be there, then we might as well have the line there and there for sure, which would then give us two spots on that side. Perfect. Two spots on that side. This is how we originally had it at the very start, wasn't it? Uh, and then we've got these in the middle, but I can't get two. I can't cram like a, a line down the middle here. So instead... We've made a door. What about a door to be able to get up into the... Or an elevator or whatever, you know, to get up into the place. You'd have a door there, wouldn't you? Yes. Need to be able to get out of here. Oops. And we'll put a little bit of this down. I don't think I like them there. I think I like them there. Yeah. So then, basically, that would give us eight car parking spots down here. Which is, I think, is a decent amount for a, a tiny little car park like this. we do the same on this side as well. I'll probably flip the yellow. Okay. And then the door goes there. I'm just putting like a black there to make it sort of look a bit like a door at the moment. And then these. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's, that's the sort of perfect length for the cars. You can, you can get them down to five if you are really tight on space. But ideally, for the cars that we use, you want six blocks. It sort of it fits really nicely in there then. Okay, yeah, 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 cool. Pillars. I think I probably want to stick with Cyan at least at the bottom. I don't think I want to go to cobblestone walls. I think it would look too thin in there. So let's go with probably stone brick. Down here. Like that. And I'll probably stick these back on top again. I think that looks pretty neat. Which basically deci decides for us. Oh no it doesn't. We can, we can do either. We can either have the roof on this layer. And it would be a full block. Or we can have it on this layer and have now i don't like the half above it i think i like the the full block above like that okay let's just fill this in it's not actually much uh to fill in at all so we can just do this together and then we need to think about some lighting i might even put some pipes down here you know those those really cool pipes that we have we used on the submarine i think we've used in a tunnel as well or a couple of tunnels maybe in the city and because we've got it up on this height, we can actually uh, connect the pipes directly to this. And it won't get in the way or anything like this. Like that. This opening on this skyscraper has been here forever. And I've always sort of thought how we could do something. I think this is going to be quite cool. It's quite like this little hidey place. Maybe you're in a, uh, a cops and robbers match or something. You can sort of just dive down here really quickly. You get across the other side of the skyscraper instantly a way to get away from helicopters as well i know unlike grand theft auto if you've got people chasing you in a helicopter you can uh dive underground like and uh through through tunnels and, and systems and stuff to get away from the police another good way meeting ground after robbing the nearby bank there's a there's a bank nearby here isn't there the, the big maze bank sort of clone you can sort of maybe rob that and then come down here to Chair the spoils you're like you're nearby dangerously close by but no but so close that nobody's gonna search right near the bank Yeah, we're quite a cool feeling down here, you know, okay uh, lights fluorescent I think it's gonna be better than the glowstone and Thank you. Oh, yeah, because there's like a lip there Okay, this is the the night vision potions make these look a little bit blue um, so that's what that is. 
So I might have to take it away. I think I leave three blocks between. Yeah. And then in there, in the middle, it's a little bit awkward again. Do something like that, maybe towards the doors. Like that over there. Yes. Lighting could be really hard to to do. That's the wrong one. So it sort of goes back like that. It should go back like that as well. I think artistically that's quite pleasing let's get some milk so i've got three minutes remaining and i can't be bothered to wait that long yeah cool i think that looks really nice uh piped we'll grab a straight pipe and we'll grab some bent pipe i don't know if we'll need the bent pipe or anything but uh i think some straight pipe at least sort of running even if we went around the light so we could do like a straight pipe like this and then we bend the pipe this way I think like not too much of this kind of thing and then bend it to go that way maybe not into that maybe that looks a little bit weird can I get it coming down would it come down or do I have to do it like that that would work we go just sort of covers that up then doesn't it yeah i mean just literally just a couple of those works quite nicely um i expect this would be like a staff car park so we don't need to worry about any kind of pay machines or anything like that I think it's pretty good. I think I'm pretty happy with this. I don't think we need anything on the walls. We don't need any paintings. We don't need need anything like that. You know what I might do though? I might change this block here to stone brick so it sort of matches that way. Um, let me just try it replace 112 with 98 yes that one to that one I think it's a little bit more uniform sometimes the l less blocks that you uh, choose between the better effect you end up getting not all the time, but sometimes. Yeah, okay. I think that works quite well. Let's grab ourselves a car. We'll go on the outside. Oh, I need some lighting to get down the stairs as well, don't we? Uh, fluorescent. You can't shift click on them. But it gives you a different f fluorescent for some reason. I don't know why. Yeah, probably just that one, in fact. Like that. Okay. Let's grab ourselves a vehicle. Uh, again, we don't want something too tall. Well, I tell you what, you can't. You could probably get a van down here. We'll we'll try with a normal car first. So we'll get a uh, I want Ferrari, a little Nissan here. I like using the normal cars as much as possible. Uh, I'm on the wrong side. That's right. We'll drive around. Let's uh, clear my inventory. Okay, I'm in the passenger seat. Hang on, you can't drive from there. That's better. <laughs> so let's drive around to the entrance. There's a cow here. How am I getting all these little passive mobs at the minute? Okay. Come around here. Nicely done. Tap on the brakes. Turn it in. You know what? That steepness, that isn't bad at all. That works quite well. And then you'd swing it, you got mind your wing mirror. Be careful. Yeah. 
and I bounced off something. Ooh, I'm reversing. Okay, I think we're good. I, uh, I might have touched the wall a little bit. I might have, I might have just touched the wall a little bit. It's okay. Let's get it out. So, reverse out. Look at this. Missing the pole entirely. I haven't even touched the pole. There's nothing connecting. I've still got my wing mirror, as you can see. And forward. Please go forward. Car, thank you. And out we go. Man, there's a, a uh, underground car park near me. Uh, one of the closest ones to me. And it is so steep to get down there. Like, to get up, you're almost burning your clutch out just to get sort of up there. Okay, could we get... Let's try... I, I don't want to try one of those ones. Can we get... Is this an ambulance one or is this a fire engine one? This is an ambulance one. Can we get an ambulance down here? That's something quite important. We're going to go... Th Oops. That's the passenger seat. We're going to go through the um, exit, though. Because we're in ambulance, we're allowed to. Let's go F5 as well. Oh, plenty of room. Plenty of room down here. Okay. So the next one is like a swap truck. It's probably the next size up. Which is this one. It's a little bit taller. Horrible sounds. Yeah. That gets down here as well. I think we've got a money truck, don't we? Like the, the ones that you would use on GTA to nick... Yeah, bank truck. Yeah. Like the ones in GTA that you uh, you can rob. That would be really cool to take down there as well. Uh, okay. And what about then? Like a large tank truck. That is such a terrible sound on, the, on these vehicles. Oh, it does! Oh, I think that's a success then. I don't think you could get much better than a success than getting one of these down here. It's not even clipping through anywhere. It's perfect. We have nothing bigger, do we, apart from planes? Um, you can't really get bigger than a lorry, can you? Fire engine isn't going to be bigger. Well, these tall-sided vans, are these a little bit taller? Oh, they are. They're a little bit taller. Little ice cream van. Place another one down. Get out of here. No. No. I've got a van in a van. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> no. Let's get out of F5 mode. I want one of these. And I want to get in it. No, I just placed another one. Thank you. Okay, no sound from this one. Oh, now, now we do. It's not reverse sound. Okay, this is going to be the tightest. Oh. Oh. You know, that probably initially clips through a little bit. But what about... Once you're down here, you're fine. You just sort of clip that glass a tiny smidge. All in all, well, I didn't on the way out. That's weird. So you don't hit it on the way out, but you just barely by like an eighth, an eighth of a block. It was like literally the first pixel you sort of touch. I could get rid of the glass and, and boom, it would be perfect. But uh, I'm happy with that. I think that's quite cool. Ooh. I broke a block. Must have been when I backed into it. All right. Success episode. If you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. We shall see you in the next episode. Bye!